You know what that pays you? Oh my God, it pays you a lot of money. All I want you to do is get paid what you're worth. And I'm going to tell you this, whatever you think that you're worth, you're worth about 10 times more than that, I promise you. I'm going to explain something to you, all right? Everything you want in life, it'll all decide on your actions now. And by the way, you can't recreate by coming one day. That's not how it works. How it works is deciding to make a commitment that from this point forward, we never quit again, never. Tomorrow, I'm going to push your f harder than you ever imagined in your life. I will come at you, and some of you aren't going to like me. And you know what my goal is? My goal is to either make you walk out of that room or decide to man the f up and change. And I'm going to tell you this. I don't care who you are in your store right now. Good job. I'm glad you got to where you are. Let me ask you this. If I pulled you in the middle of the room and I put the top salespeople all around the country in front of you, could you take them down? Could you? Huh? The deal is you can. You can. You can be that good. You know what that pays you? Oh, my God. It pays you a lot of money. All I want you to do is get paid what you're worth. And I'm going to tell you this. Whatever you think that you're worth, you're worth about 10 times more than that, I promise you. First of all, you got to believe. If anybody in here doesn't believe that they're capable of a phenomenal life, you look at someone, I don't care who it is, you look at someone, you're like, man, I want to be like them. Great. You can. I'm going to understand this. They went through sacrifice. They suffered. They worked through stress, massive amounts of it. Failure, 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 failure. Didn't quit. Now they got it. I want to tell you this, man. Every single person, I would tell you this, create a fire inside of you. If you don't have a fire in your belly, I'm going to tell you this, you're not going to make it. It's just the truth. And by the way, if you are skilled and you know all the word tracks and everything, but you're not hungry, you're going to get your ass kicked. Someone else less as talented, half as talented as you is going to come kick your ass. My goal is, is this. Here's the test. Here's the answers to the test. I wrote on my hand earlier, the key to winning long-term in life, like long-term, right? Do you guys want to make a bunch of money one year, two years? You want to make it your whole life? Oh, I love it. Your whole life, that's it. How many times have you guys seen somebody that's had a good marriage for one year, two years, $100,000 wedding, great best pictures in the world, you and your wife are looking like, fuck, man, you know? <laughs> These guys got the best life ever. Two years later, they're, they're taking pictures, going to church every Sunday together, and then you see them get a divorce. You know what? The wedding day wasn't enough to sustain it. Here's what I'm gonna tell you. Whatever you put into something is what you'll get out of it, okay? Whatever you're willing to grow will grow. You need to grow your work ethic. You need to grow your mental toughness. I wrote on my hand, the key to winning long-term in life Look for ways to multiply your mental toughness and di discipline. Multiply it. Mental toughness and discipline. Some of you guys in here right now, look, man, strip down naked, get in front of the mirror. Men, women, I'm just saying, are you happy? Really? Did you earn that? Yeah, you did. Whether you earned it in a good way or a bad way. Can I ask you a question? Are you going to need the energy if you want to be in the best in the world? Are you going to need the energy to keep going? Yes? Cool. Do you got to be in shape? You have to be in shape. I'm just telling you the truth. Look, man, if you want me to lie to you, cool. I'll tell you this. Look, you can be in here. You can get out of shape. You can go make a bunch of money, which I know people that do it. They look in the mirror and they hate themselves. That money doesn't make them feel good at all. I see more people with money commit suicide than ever before. You know why? Because they throw away their life pursuing money. Money doesn't mean anything. And by the way, if you feel rich, you'll get rich. Okay, there's something about when you deal with someone and you're meeting somebody, when they have that special energy and aura and that magneticness about them that you just wanna stay around them longer, you're just like, oh my God, man, I wanna do everything with this person. Is it because that person has money or they feel special and you feel special when you're around them? Is that you? Look, that's a perspective in a way that you feel and I think that you guys can all possess that. And I'm gonna tell you this, especially car guys, car men and women, you guys aren't car salesmen. Okay, you guys are business people. Let's get it straight. All right, you're, you're not car salesmen, okay? Listen, the car business has been really good to me and it's amazing, okay? But I'm gonna tell you, you're business, okay? Business people know how to treat other people. Look, guy comes in, he's fucking piece of trash. He drags in, he's got 400 credit score. You still treat him like a million dollars. Listen, don't disrespect people, okay? Half of you guys in here got bad credit. Why did it happen? You made a bad decision at some point. Do you think this person's still alive and breathing? Yeah, they made a bad decision at one point. You think they're happy about it? No, treat them good. The way that you treat other people, all of a sudden, though, I believe the world will recognize that and it'll pay you back in return. 
okay? Whether you can sell them or not, I'm just telling you this. It doesn't have to be based off of money, all right? There are certain things that will catch up with you and you will build a name in your community. Everybody will know who you are, what you do, how great you are at what you do and where you're at. And you will dominate the back backyard and you'll know everybody. Secondly, if you can't talk about money, nobody will spend money with you. Tomorrow we're gonna to talk about closing, negotiating all day. We're gonna speak. I'm gonna put some of you guys up on the spot. You know what you're gonna do? You're gonna stutter step and I'm gonna know that you've been winging it your whole life right out the gate. The reason why you're getting the results that you're getting right now, even if they're better than normal, is because you worked your ass off and you forfeited your life so that you can make the money that you're making. You have zero skill, zero. Your skill is you have massive work ethic, but you have zero skill. You could take that same work ethic, work half the hours, and you could triple your skill and you'd make three times the money. I'm gonna tell you this, look, what's the value if we all throw our life in the trash can, right? I'm just gonna ask you, make a bunch of money and we don't love ourselves. nothing. Can you guys love other people if you don't love yourself? There's no way. You can't build another person up if you know inside you're a fraud and you don't like yourself. How can you possibly tell another person how to spend your money if you're not financially making good decisions with your money? Am I right?